What's up everyone, Trooperhorn23 here, and today we're going to learn how to install the Spotlight mod for LSPDFR. So what this mod does is it adds a realistic spotlight to your police car, which you can control and turn on and off anytime you like during the day or night, although I don't know when you'd use it during the day. Mainly use it during the night, of course. So this is all we're going to need, the Spotlight 1.3, the link will be in the description. When you click it, it's going to bring you here. Go ahead and hit download this file and agree and download and drag it out to your desktop like so. Next, navigate to your Grand Theft Auto main directory. Make sure it's just Grand Theft Auto 5 and not dash copy or anything like that. Once you're in here, you want to go into the plugins folder. And once you're in the plugins folder, we're going to open what we just downloaded, the Spotlight 1.3. And in it, it's going to have Spotlight resources, license.md, readme, and spotlight.dll. This is really easy. All you're going to want to do is click on this Spotlight Resources folder to highlight it like that. Press Control on your keyboard and click Spotlight.dll. So now both of these are highlighted and drag them into your plugins folder. And that is really it. After you're done with that, you can go ahead and X out of both of these and we can head on into the game. Before we go in game, guys, don't forget that I do have a community Discord where you can come in here and chat with other people that play LSPDFR, including myself. I also have all my mods listed here, so if you're interested in any mods that I have, they are all listed here. If you have any issues with installing LSPDFR or any mod that I'm showing, or any problem with GTA, I also have help channels where you can come in here and ask your problem, and I have a few helpers, and I'm usually on all the time, so feel free to DM me if you have any issues or anything like that. I think I just hit 133 members, and I'm always looking for more, so feel free to join. The link to the Discord will be in the description. So once we're in game, guys, I'm going to go ahead and set the time to night, and I'm against a wall. Uh, you want to get into a police car. You don't even have to go on duty for this. And just press I on your keyboard, and there it is. There's the spotlight. The way you control it was, is with the numpad, so numpad 8 is going to make it go up, numpad 2 is going to make it go down, numpad 4 is going to go left, and 6 is going to go right. Make sure your numlock is on. If it's not on, it's not going to work. So that's how you move the spotlight around. It's pretty bright, too can't tell then it's very bright and it's on the spotlight of course it also has something called a tracking mode where if you press numpad 3 it's tracking that pedestrian I don't know why you would use this ever but no matter where I turn that spotlight will always stay on her and it even tracks vehicles and it'll tell you their plate and things of that sort there we go no it's getting a ped Alright, there's the vehicle. Uh, it tells you the model, the plate, and the distance from you. It's pretty neat. I don't know when you'd ever use that, but it's there if you want it. So, yeah, that's going to do it for today's video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed, and I hope you installed the Spotlight mod. Feel free to check out all my other LSPDFR tutorials on my channel. And um, I just hit 130 subscribers, and I love all my subscribers. I'm really glad you guys are joining me on this YouTube journey of mine and I'm always looking for more subscribers so guys don't forget to like and subscribe this video I would love to see myself hit a thousand subscribers I'm saying that today which is March 30th 2020 so let's see how long it takes me to get a thousand subscribers thanks guys don't forget to join the discord and have a wonderful rest of your day